Hello everyone and welcome back. If you are new here, we are currently exploring the breathtaking islands of Lakshadweep and I'm so excited to take you on the final days of this amazing trip. We have got so much packed into these last few days. Snorkeling, scuba diving for the first time, kayaking in a peaceful lagoon and even visiting a postcard perfect island. So let's jump right in and make the most of our last days in this paradise. With only 2 days left, we were determined to make the most of our time here. After a delicious breakfast, we decided to head out for some snorkeling at the beach. Snorkeling is an incredible experience that will allow you to explore the underwater world without the need for scuba diving equipment. We spent around 2 hours snorkeling, marveling at the vibrant coral reefs and the colorful marine life. It was truly a mesmerizing sight. Once we were done snorkeling, we returned to the resort, freshened up and enjoyed a delicious lunch. Our plan was to go kayaking next, but unfortunately the weather had other plans. It started raining, forcing us to stay back in our room. However, as the rain subsided in the evening, we couldn't resist taking a blissful walk along the beach. The following day we were all set for our first ever scuba diving adventure. Welcome to scuba diving. എൻ്റെ പേര് റിസാൽ എന്നാണ് ഞാൻ ഇവിടെ അമാത്തി സ്കൂബയുടെ സ്കൂബ ഇൻസ്ട്രക്ടറാണ് നമ്മൾ എന്ന് ചെയ്യുന്നത് നമ്മൾ ബിഗിനേഴ്സിനുള്ള ഇൻട്രൊഡക്ഷൻ ഡൈവാണ് ഫ്രൈ ഡൈവ് എന്ന് പറയും ദ എക്സൈറ്റ്മെൻറ്റ് വാസ് പാൽപ്പബിൾ സ്കൂബ ഡൈവിങ് അലൗസ് യു ടു എക്സ്പ്ലോർ ദ ഡെപ്സ് ഓഫ് ദ ഓഷ്യൻ ആൻഡ് ഗെറ്റ് അപ്പ് ക്ലോസ് വിത്ത് മറീൻ ലൈഫ് ഓക്കെ നോട്ട് ഓക്കെ സംതിങ് ഗോ ആ ഗോ ഡൗൺ ഓക്കെ It was an awesome experience and we were in awe of the underwater world. Trust me, it's something you must try at least once in your life. After an amazing scuba diving session, we returned to the resort, had lunch and then headed out for kayaking.
we paddled through the crystal clear waters taking in the breathtaking views around us it was a serene and peaceful experience that we thoroughly enjoyed After our kayaking session we freshened up and embarked on another exciting journey a visit to Kalpatti island This island is known for its pristine beaches and untouched beauty. We explored the island, soaked up the sun and took in the tranquil surroundings. It was a perfect way to spend our day. As the sun started to set, we made our way back to the resort. We sat by the beach, cherishing our last night in this paradise. The next morning, we woke up early to capture the essence of the place in our photographs. With heavy hearts we left the resort at 9:30 am. Leaving Lakshadweep was tough as we had such a wonderful time there. Even though we were here for 7 days we felt it was not enough. Lakshadweep has our hearts and this has been one of the best trips we had so far. We promised ourselves to come back soon as the place and the people here stole our hearts. We landed in Kochi by 12 pm and booked a room near Alava railway station. As mentioned in my first video, we opted for a budget trip by booking a train journey between Bangalore and Kochi. This saved us a lot of money compared to taking a direct flight. If we had taken flight directly from Bangalore, the flight ticket expense alone would have been 4 times higher. I highly recommend planning your trip this way for a budget friendly option. So that's it for today's video and thanks for staying till the end. If you enjoyed watching it, please hit the like button and subscribe for more amazing content. I'll see you soon with another video. You guys stay safe and stay happy. Bye.